Hampton takes it on the sweep, but he's taken down after a loss of one on the play. Trayvon Booker. May drops back. Pressure coming. Flushed out of the pocket, and he's taken down and sacked near the 37-yard line. And prior to last week, they'd scored at least 24 in every game, and Williams gets wrapped up near the five-yard line. Cayman Rucker, one of the most physical players on this North Carolina defense, takes him down, a loss of five. Four ankle for playing today. And he'll get the handoff here right up the gut and picks up the first down as he's taken down to the 20-yard line. May now takes the snap, tosses it to the end zone. It is caught for a touchdown. Welcome back, Tez Walker. 10-yard touchdown. The young man took a brutal hit last week at the end of that Georgia Tech game. This offense goes. He's the fail-safe for Drake May. Just feels really comfortable. But Tez gets a, does a heck of a job of sticking it, running that nice. Finally prevailed in the Tez Walker situation. Yeah, it's not often there you see the NCAA or all teams unified, but I feel like everybody in the country was unified on Tez. E.J. Wilkins takes it out, cuts back towards the outside, got room to run, turns the corner and out of bounds near the 40-yard line, and you see why they call him the Rocket. Williams takes the snap, he's got time, over the middle, it is caught and complete. A first down into Carolina territory by Ezariah Anderson. Anderson, the transfer from Iowa State. 55 new players on this team for Campbell. And you see Williams taking off. He's got room to run. They're still chasing him. And down near the 10-yard line. And, and get in front of the linebacker a little bit better and anticipate the linebacker shooting a gap a sider. Second and 18. And it is caught and complete on the slant there to Brandon Fights. Williams got time. Floats one to the end zone. It's caught for a touchdown. Campbell with an 18-yard touchdown. Cheney Fitzgerald with the over-the-shoulder catch. And Williams throws a dime to get Campbell within one. An impressive route by Fitzgerald, but an even better throw by Williams. Drop. I think it was a great call by the reps. I mean, offensive linemen typically hold, but you got to hold on the inside. May over the middle. Got a man caught complete for a first down. It's Nesbitt. McDowell in the backfield with Williams. Williams, he's got time. Finds his receiver with a one-handed stab there. It'll be a short gain. May hands it off. Hampton on the right side. Makes a man miss, and now he's going to take off. Dial it up. A house call for Omarion Hampton of 54 yards. And just like that, North Carolina regains the lead. And that's what this young man does so well, running the inside zone, reading it one gap at a time, a great cutback, but an even better job transferring in space to make Ed Dennis miss out there. An unbelievable run by this young man. May, with time to throw, goes to the sideline. It is caught and complete inside the 35. Pick it up. Carolina does a good job there. May takes a shot to the end zone and is caught. Touchdown. Tez Walker, his second touchdown of the game. A 31-yard strike from Drake May to Walker. Will receive to start the second half. But what are you seeing here, Orlando? Yeah, he just does a great job understanding leverage. Nice little stem inside to get the DB Harrington to flip his hips and turn around, but then comes back out. McDowell in the backfield along with Santiago as the up man. And Carolina coming with a blitz, and they take down Williams, Cedric Gray. You want to talk about one of the most physical players on this defense. You're looking at him right there. Trying to take Hampton down. He's alone. And Hampton again trying to spin out of trouble. He's trying to push the pile. Can he get in? Do they signal? Waiting for the officials. Yes. Touchdown. Hampton, fourth straight game with 100 yards or more. 
And now he gets into the end zone for the second time. But that one, it deserves, everybody deserves to get a touchdown next to their name on this Carolina offense because it truly took a village and everybody. Second and 19 now for Carolina. May, all day to throw, takes a shot and it's caught by Nesbitt inside the 20 yard line. Was something that he did a really good job of in camp. May flings it wide open. Chapman down the sideline and tripped up near the 25 yard line by Trevon Booker. Camel's defense, they just let Chapman loose on that one. May the toss to Copenhaver. Copenhaver headed towards the end zone. Touchdown! Touchdown, North Carolina. A 20. Love all their tight ends. They have different abilities, but Copenhagen just squeaking out the backfield behind the line of scrimmage right there with plenty of sound to get some momentum going their way. Williams tosses to Fitzgerald. Fitzgerald then taken down behind the line of scrimmage. He's been doing it the right way, and you can tell he really cares about these young men, but more importantly, the Carolina community as well. Over the middle, Williams caught for a first down. There's Araya Anderson. Williams with time. Intercepted. Sailed one a little too far. And Marcus Allen comes up with the pick. Second and three. Pressure. And May takes a big hit. A vicious hit by C.J. Tillman at midfield. That double move, Towards yeah. the inside, yeah. Yeah, yeah, the double move. Fights to field the punt for Campbell inside his 10. A fair catch at the 5. Yeah, talking to Coach Mac Jones, Mac Brown earlier this week, he said they're 6-2. and two. He's not going to hold his head down. He's still going to be confident and happy with where his team is at right now. Williams on the run, still going, makes a man miss, and he drags a defender near the 40-yard line. He's got about 70 yards on the ground rushing. Williams got time here, now in trouble. Throws it away, but was he out of the tackle box is the question. Four punts is not a Whoa, lot. Oh, and a fake. And the ball's on the ground. They're fighting for it. 35 to 7, 720 left in the third quarter. May takes a shot wide open in the end zone. Caught. Touchdown. JJ Jones. And Drake May. It's like target practice out there. A complete miscommunication in the back end for the Campbells. They just dropped J.J. Jones completely loose. To no avail to the officials. Hand off in the backfield, wrapped up immediately. They were missing Teon Holloway, amongst others. And Williams wrapped up again, taken down by Amari Campbell. To try to take advantage of the middle of the field. They did that earlier in the game, and there's a running back screen, but to the right side, and will lose yardage. Yeah, that's going to be hard with the defense that's in pass rush mode when you do a quarterback change. Handoff up the middle. Huge hole! A first down for North Carolina. And Amari and Hampton. The kick is up, and... Good. And Miami's got to go out there and, and take care of business. They've been struggling the last couple weeks. Oof. Big hit there. Brandon fights with the catch. And now apparently him and Steve Smith have chatted. And uh, they're all good now. Pass there is complete to Ezariah Anderson at the 30-yard line. But, you know, Dave Dorn, he is feisty, man. And I just looked this up. I heard today. Oof. And a huge loss there for Campbell. The North Carolina defense swarming. Here in Chapel Hill, <laughs> Hill as the Tar Heels lead Campbell 45 to seven.
listen, you better be careful. Harrell with a big run on the keeper here. They're chasing him. Can he make it to the end zone? He does for the touchdown. What a run there. 61 yards to the house. Connor Harrell. Can we check the GPS on that one? Connor Harrell, unbelievable speed. I didn't know this young man was as fast as he is. Great read, but even better wheels. He's that added dynamic. You th Look at what Drake May has done. How many championships this school has won in all the different Olympic sports. Yeah, there's a lot for sure. Williams over the middle finds his man for a big completion. Ezariah Anderson with a first down and then some as he gets taken down. Cold this morning, about 34 degrees, but 70 here at game time. I can deal with that. It's just the snow part I don't love. Oh, ball's on the ground. And it's going to be North Carolina football. Connor Harrell takes a deep shot. Got a man. It's caught for a touchdown. Chris Comer, the freshman from North Carolina. 6 1, 185. A big strike. Yeah, Chris Culliver, just one of the most talented guys in that room, this coaching staff said. North Carolina sideline. The 15 yard penalty will be enforced on the kickoff. Sideline getting a little too happy right there with the celebration. <laughs> but um, Chris Culliver, this coaching staff is excited about this young man. North Carolina gets a win today, a big one, 59 to 7. They improved to 7 and 2 overall, 16 straight wins over FCS foes. And have won eight of the last nine in non-conference home games.